What's up guys? So yesterday, um, my wife and I had decided we were going to go and do a few things. So we, we leave the house and um, we only get up the road maybe not even five minutes up the road. And there's a Pennsylvania State Trooper who was right behind us. And then I jumped over into the right lane and he passed us in the left lane, the fast lane. And then as he got a little further up the road, he decided to get back over into the slow lane. And I had already gotten back over into the lane that he was in. So we ended up passing him. Now mind you, the traffic is moving very slow because of the, you know, the holiday and what have you. And just out of nowhere, he pulls right up behind us and he hits his lights and he pulls me over. And he tells me that the reason that I pulled you over was for the tint on your windows. And I'm like, okay, uh, the tint on the windows. And he said, yes, sir. He said, we need to be able to see, you know, who's inside the vehicle. Um, he said, it's for our protection. And I said, well, I understand that. And, um, you know, he said, is this something that you just had done? And I said, no, I had this tent since I bought this car four years ago. He's like, oh. I understand where he's coming from, but I have had in the four years numerous state troopers, cops come right up behind me and, and, and pass me, and not one of them has ever, ever pulled me over for the tint on my windows. So now, as you can see, I have to take the tent off. And I gotta show up in court. I have to show up in court to prove that I'm taking the tent off of my windows. Ain't that something? So, there you go. There you go. Only the two front windows. The two front windows. He said he's okay with the rest of it. So it doesn't matter who's in the back seat. It's who's driving. That's who he wants to see. You know, guys, I, I just, I find it to be rather, uh, I don't know. It's pretty, it's pretty interesting to me on how they will pull you over for just about anything today. If my windows were totally blackened out then I can understand, but my windows are not totally blackened out. Um, you know, he, he was telling me that he wished that, he wished that their windows could be um, tinted, but they're not allowed to have tinted windows either, um, which didn't make any sense to me. But I can guarantee you this, I bet you his personal vehicle's got tinted windows. Okay. Guarantee it. Almost guarantee. But as you can see, this, this comes off. Comes off fairly easy. There it is. That was. That was the. Uh, tent that was on my my window and as you can see you can probably see that you can see through it but he's telling me to either pay the fine either pay the fine or uh I need to show up in court and I ain't paying no damn fine for something that 
you know, that I have, you know, I've been, I've had, had this car for four years. Although the, the more I thought about it, I'm thinking, you know, maybe I should have just paid the fine and chances of me getting pulled over again for the tent is probably real slim. I, I think this was, uh, let's see how much money we can make the state for the, for the holiday weekend. That's, that's, that's what I think. I think that's all it was. So, there you go, guys. There you go. I'm going to finish this one up, and then I'll jump to the other side and show you that one.